Hi everyone, my name is Ryan Suze Avery. I am a writer, director and actor. Um, during lockdown, really, it's, uh, it's, been, it's been quite something. It's been quite fun. Um, in a way that it's, it's helped me kind of reflect on my kind of personal growth in the, in the industry. Um, and as a writer, it's kind of helped me reflect on what I really want to be talking about, what stories I want to tell. Uh, not the ones to just write and, you know, make money, if that makes sense. Um, the ones that are true to me and the ones that kind of, you know, hopefully that will stick with people who read it and who hopefully in the future will watch it. Um, I've, you know, currently working on a, uh, a project with a group of friends of mine um, called Suppression, The Suppression of Hannah Stevenson, um, which is currently on hiatus due to the, the outbreak and, and coronavirus, but it's looking to be something fantastic. Um, the uh, director, Jason Parker, is uh, an amazing friend and a really skilled director. Um, all the actors and actresses in that film are fantastic and highly skilled. Um, and a big thank you to every you know one of them for still wanting to um, continue the, uh, the journey, the filmmaking journey, um, obviously after lockdown's over and finished. Um, for myself, I've been working on a project titled Dark Fools, um, which is about a writer as well, quite funnily, um, and his kind of journey with his kind of inner, inner, inner demons and inner struggles. Um, but yeah, I mean, I think we all need to look at this time in lockdown as a time of reflection, a time of reset, like reset your values and your priorities um, in your life to ultimately have a happier and uh, a more positive kind of existence. I don't want to get too deep, but um, I think that's what life is about. It's about kind of going through it happy, making sure other people are happy, um, and making the world a better place. Um, but yeah, uh, thank you so much for the opportunity to, um, to, tell, the, to tell my lockdown story, um, and I hope everyone is staying safe and keeping well. Thank you.